Hello everybody and welcome back. So today I am going to be continuing work on this piece right here. And one thing I noticed after uh, finishing my live stream last week was that, uh, as I was saying last week, the, the orange colour wasn't exactly what I was expecting. However, now that it's actually dry, it looks a lot more fluoro. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna, I'm not 100% happy with the colours for this painting so far, so I'm gonna play around with um, fixing up the colours really. Because <laughs> I don't want to do any like detail and realise, hmm, that's not quite right. orange this can be. We'll do this. I think that colour is already better. Like it's already looking way more the type of orange that I was after. But I'm just I don't know how it's gonna dry because it's got the fluorescent colour mixed in with it. So I'm like it could dry just like super ugly. I have no idea. We'll just, we'll test it out together. And I'm thinking maybe even making the green a lighter colour as well. I know this is where like a darker colour is going to go, but I've just got too much paint and I'm like, well, I may as well just paint it, paint it everywhere. Oh, if I, when I like, if I choose this colour, I'll obviously make, mix it up again. It was super easy to make. Ooh, I do like that. I like the light. Colored eyes. I think I prefer that being a lighter green. I think that works and I'm I definitely am happy with the the hair. And I also think maybe cuz the shirt color here this should be gray but it's like way too it's very blue. So I'm not sure about that. It's just it's hard to see like it's hard to visualize the right colors when I'm staring at the colors as they are right now. Um, but I think I might go over the the lines. Yeah, in this, I don't know if you guys can tell, but the lines are kind of purple. And I think that's also throwing off, you know, how I'm, how I'm seeing it all. So. I think I'm just gonna, we're gonna redo the lines and I do that quite regularly anyway with with this type of art. I'll do the lines, paint over them a bit, but I can still see them and then I'll go over them again and then maybe paint over them again, but I just gonna keep them there so that when I do like the final layer of the lines, I can still see where they are and I don't lose them too much. So let's Let's do that. There it is. That's the Stardew painting. It looks much better up close because back there it's like you can't see a lot of detail. But 
That's probably the best lighting there. Oh, that is incredible. Thank you. Yeah, I'm, I'm super happy with how it turned out. I think I'm going to work on the, the shirt color. I don't know if I should leave this color lighter or if I should just fill in the shirt completely with like black. I don't, I don't know. The shirt, it's a bit darker. It's definitely more gray than blue. Because I don't want there to be any blue. I want this piece to be just like orange, green, and yellow. There we go. That's pretty much where I'm at at the moment. I do think the colors look better. I do like the shirt being a lot darker. And just fixing up that, the color of the hair, like it was I can tell that the fluor is coming through, which is nice, but it's definitely more orange. It was just like too red, which is not what I would expect from a color that has like this bright orange on it. But, you know, that happens sometimes. But I'm going to end it here. So thank you so much for watching. I had a lot of fun hanging out with you guys. Um, if you're watching on YouTube, which you might be because I will probably edit this together to go on YouTube, if you want to catch any of my future live streams, just go to twitch.tv forward slash mxmarie, click the little heart, that means you're following me, and if you're watching on Twitch, if you are enjoying the stream, feel free to follow, that way you will, um, be able to see when I'm live, um, but yeah. Anyway, that is all from me today, so thank you for watching, and I will hopefully see you sometime soon. Bye!